And bring me down your dirty clothes, too. As a single mother, Laura Adkins leads a busy life. Between her job, her daughter, and chores around the house, she's constantly on the go. Like a lot of us, Laura uses a PDA. But unlike most of us, Laura is using hers to battle breast cancer. The PDA gives me a place to, as a framework to put all of those em emotions and symptoms and put it put it down someplace and I can see what's happening to me. Laura is part of a new study launched by Dr. Charles Shapiro and his colleagues at Ohio State's James Cancer Hospital. Shapiro has been treating women with breast cancer for decades and has come to realize how important information can be as part of that treatment. What we're asking patients to do is record their symptoms in real time and then present these to the doctor. So every time patients like Laura experience pain, fatigue, or depression, they simply jot it down on these specially designed PDAs. Shapiro says that's helpful because okay. women may have Good. to wait weeks until their next doctor's appointment, and by then they may not have an accurate account of what they've been through. But with these, they will. This is a unique study, and if it works, I think it'll be very, very useful, perhaps practice changing in the way we assess patients. By knowing just what patients are going through and when, doctors can better help them by prescribing certain medicines or altering treatments, or by simply offering some timely advice. Fatigue will get better once the chemotherapy stops. All of which can make patients feel more in control of their condition and improve their quality of life. At Ohio State University's James Cancer Hospital, this is Clark Powell reporting.